Wait, what town are we in? Hello and welcome to Imperfectly Me Crafts. Five minute flights. We are here at Highwire Brewing in Louisville. Louisville. <laughs> Louisville. Louisville. Lou it's not Louisville. <laughs> Louisville. Kentucky. This is a bonus state. We were only going to do 12 states. We got 13 now. Here we go. So uh, here, I mean, first of all, the place is awesome, but we're going to get right into the flight. We're starting with a low pitch hazy IPA. This is uh, American IPA, 5.5% ABV. Easy drinking says. Let's see how it smells. It smells like citra. You got the citra hops up front. Let's see how it tastes. Ooh, bigger hop bite than I was expecting. That might be a bunny foot and a half. Um, very tasty though, smooth, drinkable. Um, yeah, it has uh, just a bit of a bite at the back end. Mm. That's really nice. The next one is a Pink Lemonade Session Sour Ale. This is a 4.2% ABV, fruited sour. And first of all, cool color. Liking the color on this one. Let's see how it smells. It doesn't tell me which fruit they use, so I, well, I mean pink lemonade, so I'd assume there's lemon. <laughs> I guess that's kind of a given. But yeah, um, I'm just gonna have to dive right in. Cheers, everyone. By the way, hello. Chu just reminded me that I didn't say, I'm Mallory and choose behind the camera. <laughs> Guess what? I'm Mallory and choose behind the camera. This is not nearly as sour as I expected it to be, which is nice. I like it. It's uh, got a sweetness, a softness. There is lemon. There is almost a strawberry gentleness to it, a berry of some sort. Mm. But that's like one pucker. That's, that's really, really drinkable. Next one. This one is called 10W40, which made me laugh when I saw the name, so I knew I had to drink it. 10W40. I know, I know what the name was. I already said it. But, sorry, Chu's sitting far enough away from me that he can't hear what I'm saying, so he is not sure what I said. Uh, 10W40 is an Imperial Stout. This is an 8% ABV. And again, I got nothing, so let's see how it smells. Ooh, heavy espresso, dark espresso, a little bit of vanilla, and a teensy bit of baker's chocolate. See how it tastes? Much sweeter than I expected. This is uh, supposed to be like an iced coffee. It definitely comes across as like an iced coffee, like a latte with like a pump of vanilla, um, but with whole milk. It, it's very creamy, very soft, very sweet, <clears throat> and it's an eight percenter, so I could have two. <laughs> no, you can't. Okay, fair enough. And then the last one is their <laughs> Zirkus Fest. So first of all, fun name. I'm not finding it on my phone, so I'm going without the information. It is a six percent ABV, I know that much. And guess what, guys? We started a trend yesterday. We are back on Oktoberfest. Oktoberfest beer taken over in August. At least it's not July. Let's see how it smells. Ooh, sweetness, a corn, wheat, soft grain. Let's see how it tastes. Roll out the barrel. Oh, nice. Teensy hot bite at the end, drinks like an amber, soft malty goodness. That is really lovely. Mm. So, uh, we are here in Louisville. 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 <laughs> I, I keep looking over here because my friend Shannon and Todd are here, who we met through Rod J's Beer Ventures. If you haven't checked out Rod J's Beer Ventures, every Toss One Back Thursday, he has Shannon and Todd on his channel. Totally worth watching. They're so much fun. They have been kind enough to bring us over here to High Wire to check it out and offer all of you guys this bonus extra state to our trip. So super fun. Um, Who's that painting behind you? What? Who's the painting behind you? Oh, and Ma Muhammad Ali? Yes. Okay. <laughs> I blanked for a second. 
because we are in the home of Muhammad Ali. This place is awesome. Gotta come check it out if you come down to Louisville. <laughs> 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 Cheers, everybody. <laughs>